guys and hope my project at mega 2560 is inductance meter i find the source code inside the youtube and I try to convert the crystal LCD to the oil you want and make a little bit change. And finally, I take very good result and compare it with the um, component tester. And the result and the answer are very similar. So, uh, I should say for this project, I try to use regulated power supply 5 volt. And this regulated power supply is connected to the power source like 5.2 volt. And the regulated power supply output is connected to the Arduino Mega. And it needs two wire to the project. Project need one comparator. I see I use LM339 multi purpose or general purpose comparator I see and you can see a simple diode will make the frequency and the output will transfer the frequency to the uh, at mega and this calculation will make the inductance but the thing is we should know we need one uh, capacitor constant and a stable capacitor to calculate and measure the inductance and frequency uh, to start the project i used this 105 tantalium capacitor but the result was not stable and not good but today i tried to use this one is a one mega one, one microfarad capacitor 250 volts and this is the field capacitor I think and is working pretty well so we need this capacitor to make calculation and send the answer to the OLED of course we need this capacitor to run the project and the inductor or the codes like these comes and be serial to the project and the answer finally will be sent to the mega 2560 so i will try to reset the project yeah we can see we have nothing in and i'm going to test the first uh, inductor like this this is smd1 and i try to make legs and i'm doing this to calculate to measure the inductance yes i'm going to here yeah and this is the result when i unplug the inductor the result is the last and the best average number for the inductance to next um, inductance test I'm going to check with this one as soon as I plug the inductor the calculation will start and you can see the numbers coming in it's very stable after changing this capacitor you it would be better for you to use two one microfarad frame resistors in parallel but i have one and only just use this one but if you use two uh, capacitor is much better as a two microfarad so i'm unplugging the hundred my hundred and you can see the this is very really stable and very good result for this one so i'm going to test with uh, resistor type inductor like this i'm plugging and it's going to measure the number and it's very very 
good resolution for the measurement of the inductance. I'm unplugging and the number going to stable. 29, 874 micro hungry. And the last one is crying inductor style like this. With the crying one I'm playing. Unplug the inductor. You can see as soon as I plug the inductor, the inductance will be start to measure and it's going to stable as soon as I unplug the inductive and is it 37 so don't forget to running this project use very stable power supply and disconnect the project from USB and computer PC or laptop because of uh, we should have minimum noise to measure the exact and stable inductance when we have separated power supply with DC input we have very very good result and much better and stable thanks for watching this project let me know your idea about this calculation and goodbye thank you